At eight weeks old, Angus needs to sleep up to 20 hours a day. But today, he's waking up to a whole new world. So, so far, Angus has only met things around the house. He's met the cats and things like that. But today, I have a lot of ranch chores to do. So it's the perfect day to bring Angus outside. Come on. The Soltz family live on a small farm, and Adrian knows that Angus has a lot to look out for. All right, Angus. There's a lot going on on a little ranch. We have a lot of visitors and a lot of activities on a daily basis. I want to make sure that Angus gets to know everything and he's comfortable. One of the main goals to introduce Angus to a chicken, we let them out and we let them graze. And I don't want Angus to ever mistake them as dinner. Uh oh. He's also got to make friends with the other dogs on the ranch, including Olive, a great Pyrenees cross. You're never quite sure when you bring a new puppy home how they're going to be. Olive is such a big dog that I'm more worried about how Olive behaves around Angus than Angus behaves around Olive. Olive weighs in at 150 pounds, more than eight times heavier than the new Great Dane puppy. See, that's Olive. Say hi, Olive. You gonna be good to him? Olive may be giant, but she's very gentle. Really nice to see Olive being so sweet to him. Angus will soon outgrow Olive. Even at 18 weeks, he'll be almost two and a half feet tall and weigh up to 80 pounds. But even a fully grown Great Dane needs to learn not to mess with the biggest animals on the ranch. Horses are my biggest concerns. Say hi, Wizzy. Make sure that he respects them. Oop. He stays out of their way and out from underneath their feet so he doesn't get hurt. He's definitely curious about the horses and the horses don't like him. 